today we're going to be cleaning this entire house. The whole thing needs a really good clean. I've been out of town and my house is very small. We've got 576 square feet so it gets out of hand rather quickly. Hi. It's also a very Let rainy day and Jason's working from home Let and my niece is also here so you may see some crazy things coming in and out of the rooms but we're gonna get it done and we're gonna get this house picked up and nice and clean. It's been a while since I posted one of these whole house clean with me's and that's because it's been a while since I cleaned my whole house at one time. Um, if you've been around for a little while, you know I've been really, really busy lately. I've got a lot going on, um, a lot of personal stuff, but I've shared a lot of that with you. But I'm ready to kind of get the house refreshed, get it clean so we can live our daily lives like we normally do. on everything so you can see that I started out with laundry and I believe I've showed you this trick before but there's one really fast way to hang all your clothes at once and I just stack them all as I'm pulling them out I stack them all nicely and then it only takes me like a minute or less to hang up every single one of them in the stack see I've had a wardrobe change this was a different day because I got busy on the day where I started this video and I just decided to finish it up another day which is fine sometimes we have to do that for ourselves and that's okay during this whole experience of the illness that I've been going through and then losing my grandpa I've just kind of learned that I need to de-stress and find ways to de-stress and a lot of the stress that I had was me putting pressure on myself. So I'm releasing that pressure and I'm just doing things as I can and I'm really trying to keep up with videos for you guys and doing my best <laughs> to get at least two videos out a week and hopefully I'll just be able to build up from there. I know I've showed you this one before, but we save space on our movies. We're big movie buffs, so we like to have physical DVDs because you never know when you're going to lose this satellite internet out here. So we always just keep them in these little CD cases, 
and I cut out the front of them so the kids know where to put them back. But sometimes it takes me reorganizing it. It's been a while since I've actually stayed on top of them putting them back. So that's why I had to go through and kind of put everything back where it goes and we had some new, new DVDs that had to go in there too. And I did move some things around in the living room about a week or so ago. This little table used to be where my file cabinet was, but I switched them around because I do like using this for my computer when I'm sitting on the couch um, and, you know, to eat or whatever if we're eating in the living room. So it's kind of nice to just have it and be able to pull it out from there. And it, and it looks better than that black thing underneath the other side too. I may get something to kind of cover up the bottom of the bookshelf over there. Um, you know, because it's mainly used for storage. That's what this house is, is primarily used for storage. So that's the important thing. It's not always about the aesthetics, but it would be nice to kind of break that up a little bit just on that left side. You got me dancing in a storm, burning everything we know, dressing up as firefighters. You got me dancing in your stove, or I'm looking like a breeze, but really you're a forest fire. You got me feeling uncomplicated. Whatever happens is meant for us. Pressing into all the situations. Whatever happened, we came there first. Go a little wild is your personal expression. Far over the line, tell me we ain't so. You guys want to know what's funny I have now saved up enough money for my couch but I've been looking around on the internet and everywhere else trying to find one and I have not been able to find one that I like and I'm nervous about buying one online to see if it would actually be comfortable so if you guys have couch recommendations I would like an l-shaped sectional or you know a chaise sofa for this space but if you have recommendations please leave them in the comments i'm just looking for something super super comfortable that will fit all four of us You go. 
Since we put the air conditioners back in, everything is dustier. I don't know what it is. I guess, um, you know, they may have been a little bit dusty left over or something from last year, but I've had to redust everything in the house, which I guess that's good. It needed it. There's so much pollen outside. When we leave the doors open, I can definitely see a film over everything. So it definitely needed a good wipe down. Everything did because my allergies have been going crazy. Stay put I'm just gonna wait in the background Watching you talk to her I know this might look bad But I'm just gonna melt in the background Watching you lean into her So much under the sides of the beds I don't know how things get kicked up under here but they do and this was so cute the kids played doctor I guess with this horse and put a band-aid over it they were trying to fix him up I guess but I'll have to really fix him up sew him up good for them because they play with him all the time I know where those hair bands came from the cat likes to find them and kick them around under things and I find my hair bands under stuff all the time In the hallway here, we've been stacking things that need to go up to the attic. So we finally went ahead and completed that task and got all the heaters out of there and my window fan. Um, just put those up for the next season. And he also found some things out in storage that actually should be in the attic instead of outside. So we kind of got that stuff taken care of and cleaned up the hallway a little bit. And it feels a lot better not having all that clutter sitting there.
Still loving the dishwasher, but I told you guys that I would give you an update on the Ecos brand dishwasher liquid. And I have to say that I'm not a fan. So I'm going to try a different eco friendly um, dishwashing liquid. We do have a gray water system, so I have to be careful about what I put in the dishwasher. But I'm going to be trying a couple other brands and we'll see what comes out the best. a bright star in the dark space mm, babe it never worked out with the others all we ever did was fight and at one point i would never thought that i would meet someone like you this time it's all different you got every little string on me the way you make me feel is crazy how did you get so fly you got me like I have been wiping down the counter every day. I have to because the kids come in with their muddy hands and go straight to the bathroom and wash them. So I guess I should be thankful that the kids wash their hands, but they also leave mud everywhere. <laughs> Ringing, oh, 
always had a bad time Every time you flashed your name Always leaving Then you got me chasing you Like I'm the one to blame It always feels so nice when the whole house is clean all at one time and everything's been wiped down all the dust and pollen are gone and um, it's a really nice feeling so I hope that I've been able to motivate you to work on your house today and clean some of the areas that you need to clean maybe get all that dust and pollen out maybe get some fresh air moving in your house but thank you so much for watching and I can't wait to chat with you guys in the comments and I'll see you in the next one bye